Sexual abuse is one that educators often get training on how to report and how to recognize the signs. Sexual abuse is considered any interaction between a child and an adult or even two children where it makes the child an observer, a perpetrator, or a stimulant of sexual activity. Sexual abuse can include touching and non-touching behaviors. There are many effects of sexual abuse on a child that can be explored through the site, as well as interventions and resources. Terrorism and violence is another form of trauma experienced by children. Families and children may be profoundly affected by mass violence, acts of terrorism, and community trauma in the forms of shootings, bombings, or other types of attack. Impact will vary depending on the nature of the event of the experience of children and the families during and afterward. The site provides resources for school shootings, mass violence, and their general site-specific resources in order to help students cope with this type of trauma. This form of trauma happens when a loved one passes away. Many children adjust well after a death, but others have difficulties when they cannot recall positive memories of their loved ones. This can often trigger other forms of stressors. Again, the website lists effects and interventions as well as resources to help students cope with traumatic